is Ceodopides verticillata. This is the umbrella pine number 133. So <clears throat> this guy, uh, as the name suggests, it's the poster child for Sympodial growth or umbrella-like growth. So you can see that you have these uh, crowded leaves that are all uh, out here at the tips. And each time you have a node, you have a, um, uh, a, um, a group of these leaves uh, in this umbrella uh, pattern. So uh, it also has very distinct uh, revolute margins. And uh, the, uh, the tips of these uh, needles or leaves uh, are um, emarginate. Okay? Um, <clears throat> and it is in the pine family. Uh, it does have um, the typical, um, uh, it's monoecious. And uh, although this plant won't for a long time, it does have um, cones that are typical of the uh, pine family, and the, the male uh, cones, male pollen producing cones, smaller uh, out towards the tip. So, don't know what else to say about umbrella pine. This is a really fantastic pine. Uh, I, you're starting to see it more commonly available, um, but it is still a, a, um, a fairly underutilized uh, plant. Probably the fleshiest, I guess I could point out, it's probably the fleshiest of the uh, um, pine family uh, that we're going to do during this term. So that is uh, Ceodopides uh, verticillata. Oh, uh, one final note, uh, the term verticillata or verticillate does mean world, and so that does uh, indicate uh, that you have these uh, world uh, needles at each node.